Hello, good morning everybody. Hope you're all well. Itchy you nose, that's a good start. I'm not gonna sneeze. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Hello, hope you're all okay and uh what a change, what a change. Um, the house is a lot cooler and we have rain today. I sound like a weather girl. I'm not a weather girl, but um, the weather does uh, change how you feel, doesn't it? And I got a reasonable night's sleep as well. And Coco as well, she got a reasonable night's sleep and she's in a much better place today. So everything is good. Just wanted to catch up with you with a couple of things. Um, I mentioned yesterday that I had a small delivery from uh, Emma Bridgewater and I wanted to show you that because it was really cute I really love it and I've got a cup the same and a couple of plates so what I bought was that it's a little jug and um, perfect for things like um, orange juice or something like that so that's the jug and that's the underneath so that's what I bought I love the spouts on these things um, I don't know who designed them, but they work really, really well. So I haven't got any lipstick on my teeth, I don't think so. But um, anyway, also, while I was here, I wanted to tell you about... I know I go on about it, but um, let me start from the very, very beginning. When lockdown was coming into force, um, we would go out and go to Aldi and buy everything we needed. Since everything has happened and the cost of living has gone up, I actually don't think Aldi is the um, the store that it used to be. It's not as cheap as it used to be. So I kind of shopped around a bit more. I've got to Sainsbury's, Sainsbury's and bought different things. And also I've got an app now for Waitrose, which I actually didn't think I could afford, which is a strange thing to say, I know, but I didn't think I could afford Waitrose, but they've got an essentials range and I've been having it delivered. And I got my delivery yesterday and I went online and got a slot. So you can choose your slot as long as they're available, which was very, very busy actually. I got a slot between four and five. Then you go on and you go through your order of what you want. When you actually, the day of the delivery is when you pay. I didn't know that, but it's when you pay. Then if something they don't have, they compensate or they, what's the word I'm looking for? They they give you something, um, whether or not it's the same value or not, they give you something in replacement. So yesterday I ordered a raspberry ripple ice cream from Waitrose. They didn't have it, so they gave me Kelly's. They gave it for the price that I, that I bought for the Raspberry Ripple. So, and also the avocados, which I ordered, apparently we were on date. So I got those free. They put them in the shopping for free. And when the driver came, he was on time, he was a bit early. And he said, you know, have you looked at your, your list of things? I said, yes. He said, you know, we're gonna give you avocados free because they're on date. So that that's so nice, isn't it? And the delivery was three pounds. Now, the way I see it, okay, when you get in your car these days and you drive somewhere, the cost of the petrol is is risen so much. So three pounds delivery, when you think if you have to drive somewhere like 10 miles or five miles, I think that's amazing to have it delivered to your door doorstep for three pounds. I think that's really great. The drivers are so, so um, they're polite and uh, yeah, it's just a really nice experience. So what I'm going to do quickly is tell you a couple of prices, which um, if you compare them to Aldi or you compare them to Sainsbury's, I know I've done this before, but anybody that's struggling at the moment and is shopping around for good prices for food, um, Waitrose as long as it's not too far away and they're on your doorstep, they will deliver for £3. So I'm going to put my glasses on. I'm going to quickly go through the list. Oh, my goodness. Go through the list that I bought. OK, so what we have, we bought some Gouda, which was two thirty-five, and that's a 250 gram. I bought some 
ground coffee. Now, if you go and buy Tailors of Harrogate, they're about four pounds at the moment. I bought some Sumatra Mandeling ground coffee for three seventy five. And I tell you, it's a, a lovely coffee. If you like ground coffee, that's amazing coffee. I bought some Waitrose Meaty Strips Chicken. Oh, am I talking about the right one? Yeah, I am. Meaty Strips Chicken. And um, that was £2. I found some rum and raisin ice cream as well, which I've been searching for. And that was £4. Um, it's a 500ml tub. Um, and that was £4. It's slightly more than I would pay, but that was not too bad. Um, I bought some black currant, black currant jam, which they were letting, they were, they were reducing their own brand, Essentials, black currant jam for 80 pence. I bought two jars. I bought some lunchbox serene loaf banana. Um, you know, the malt loaf. I bought that for a pound. Um, what else can I tell you about? The white, the, the free range white eggs. They were a pound for six. So I got a dozen for two pounds. And I think that's pretty good. Don't you think that's good? I think that's amazing. So the Black Sheep Craft Bakery White Tiger Bloomer was £1.70, which I don't think is too bad. Uh, what else have we got here that I could tell you about? That's a reasonable price. Um, um, I bought some Waitrose um, bacon. That was two eighty five. Um Garlic was sixty pounds. Sixty pounds. Sixty pence. A, a like a not a clove, but a, a whole garlic. Um, I think the salad onions were seventy p. Extra large oranges were two ninety. Um, the essentials fair trade bananas were a pound. So. When you go through this, they're not that bad, are they? Not really. They're not bad at all. So this is what I wanted to say is if you're struggling, uh, Waitrose Essentials range and having it delivered and not getting in your car and using the petrol, I think that's an amazing value for money. Also, while I was here, I wanted you just to look at the cards I've made recently. It's a bit of a catch up, actually, just a bit of a chat and a catch up because I've lots, I've lots to tell you and lots to talk to you about. So um, I've made some children's cards, which I wanted to show and see what you thought. So that's the first one. I made an elephant and inside the balloon is the age three, which I thought was really cute. And what I was going to do, I was going to make different... Um, different numbers inside the cards. I don't know what you think. So that's what I've been doing in my spare time, if I have any spare time. So anyway, I wanted just to go through with the Waitrose thing because um, everyone is going to be in a different situation this winter. In October, there's going to be a, a price um, hike, which will change lots of people's way that they do things. So I think everybody's searching for a cheaper cost of living. And um, yeah, I think Waitrose is trying very, very hard to, uh, to keep up with the changing situation. So anyway, I hope you all have a great day. It's been nice to catch up. Think about Waitrose. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and um, don't forget to subscribe as you go off. Don't forget to subscribe. Um, it's great having subscribers and uh, yeah, I appreciate, I appreciate all of you. So have a great day. My name is Julie. Take care. See you soon. Bye-bye.